we're about to do an unboxing from ebay.com. That's right, folks, we are doing an unboxing from a purchase I got from ebay.com. And this one comes from a site, or you can say eBay store, called zavco.com. Yeah, zavco.com. I don't know if you can see that on there because you get like a 10% off if you use some kind of certain code. Now, I forgot <laughs> that I had ordered from Zavco before on eBay. Uh, I did that a couple of months ago when I had ordered a Walking Dead. It was uh, the Herschel Walking Dead. I don't know if you guys had seen when I unboxed this video for this one. And I said I was gonna order from them again because the box came in kind of damaged. And the pop itself, uh, the front of the box was good, Herschel. It was good, the pop itself is good, but there was a little damage right here on the corner, which is not too bad, but for in the box collectors, it's kind of bad. I don't know if you guys can see that. But if you guys go back and see that video, you can see that little uh, mess up thing right there on that box. But the rest of the box was good, the pop, it was pretty cool looking. So, I seen this one. Uh, this Funko Pop, and I had it in my want list because I wanted to pick it up, and it finally came in stock, and it showed it was in stock, so I ordered it, and the box itself, it is in good condition, so I could give them that. The last time, the box in the corner was bad. Now, they do put it in these small boxes, and if I remember correctly, they may not have been bubble wrap. So let's go ahead and see how Zafco sent this one, my second order from that company. Maybe it'll be a little bit better the second go around. Maybe the first round was just a little fluke. Let's find out. All right. Well, of course, I'm seeing it now. No bubble wrap. With this little bitty box, there will not be no bubble wrap. And the way it looks, it looks like it fits perfectly in there. And this cardboard is pretty thick. So I'm guessing if you have a good UPS or a FedEx person or United States Postal Service that delivers this, I think I got United States Postal Service. Uh, they don't bounce it around too much. It could come in good condition, but it's pretty tight. I mean, if they put something big package on top of it, it'll crush it. That's why you gotta have a little bit bigger package with some bubble wrap. All right, what did I get? It's gonna be upside down. Another Walking Dead pop. Carol, you got you girl, you guys and girls know Carol. I had to get this one. I have not seen Carol in my area. I have not seen this pop at all in my area. So I went ahead and uh, ordered it from this company here. And the box itself is in good condition by looking at it. So they did do a good job. Well, it's not really them, it's the postal service. They didn't uh, damage the box. The box is in good condition. And yeah, this is Carol. You got, got Carol. Carol, I got the shirt on right here. You know how she said that? You can never tell anyone. The cookie lady. You can't tell anyone about her cookies. It's so good. You can't tell anyone. And oh, and Carol, she also had that awesome scene. I don't know if you guys remember that. I think it was in season three or four. It was an early season in which she made Lizzie. You guys remember Lizzie? Look at the daisies. She said, the, the flowers. She said, Lizzie, just look at the flowers, Lizzie. Look at the flowers. And bam, she shot Lizzie in the back of the head. And I think everybody was shocked when she did that. But then again, Lizzie, was, she was a little look old. So, okay, let's go ahead and take a look at this Carol Pop. Go ahead and take it out of the box so we can take a look at it. Like I said, the box came in pretty awesome condition. And plus, this is a common pop. So I, I do unbox common pops. All right, first off. Uh, the pops in good condition. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna just bring it up here for you guys to see. See if I can focus in for you guys. The pop is in good condition, but there isn't a stand for this one. So I'm not sure if she's gonna stand up pretty good, but she flew out of the box. So let's take a look and see if she stands up pretty good. Let's see. Yep, she stands up. Let me bring the camera a little closer so you guys can see. There she is right there, Carol from The Walking Dead. Now, just by looking at her, I can tell that is Carol because she has that uh, jacket on that she's always wearing. And the color of that grayish hair 
and the way they have it cut they did a good job with the hair this is an awesome job with the hair yeah she has a gun in her hand so i guess that's the gun that killed lizzie <laughs> look at the flowers lizzie pretty good detail on this funko pop so now i have an extra one to add to my walking dead collection so yeah folks i had just wanted to come on here real quick and show you guys my new walking dead uh pop that i'm adding to my collection is just a common nothing spectacular but zafco they did do a good job this time and actually i'm i'm, a, I'm probably repeating myself i think it was the postal service that did a good job for not damaging it because they put it in a, in a small box now i'm noticing on the back of here they must have just made these again because uh this is not a vaulted pop and if you check the number on the back of this box here I don't know if I can focus in on that. Probably not. But on the back of the box, the uh, the number is uh, 170301. So that was made this year. This was made in 2017. So they must have just started producing some more of these. So that is it for this episode. Oh, by the way, uh, this past weekend, I did a video about the... Uh, the Star Wars Celebration Pops that I picked up. If you guys have a check out that video, go check it out. And leave me a comment on how difficult it was for you guys to pick up those Star Wars Celebration Pops. Because I'm kind of curious. So, uh, till the next video, guys. I'll see you guys later. Alrighty. Yeah, we got this here. Peanuts all over the place. Alright, folks. Some of you guys probably already know about this Funko Pop. I saw it the other day. Had to get it just to see what it looks like in person. Now, I've never seen this television show before.